Hi everyone, time for another Mad Collectible review. So in this case we're going to do Cartoonist Profiles from December 1975, number 28. Uh, so let's take a look. Okay, so this got a bit of a discussion going on Facebook recently. So one of the pictures from this particular magazine was actually used for various MAD promotional materials, including the souvenir when you visited the MAD offices. So let's have a bit of a closer look. So we have the classic logo up the top there. Uh, and then we have a picture by Jack Rickard. So each of these artists put in a picture of themselves with a t-shirt representing their own personality. So in this case, Jack Rickard has put neat art, work cheap. Then we have Jack Davis, represented by a bottle of Jack Daniels. Uh, we have Paul Coker Jr. with down with t-shirt graffiti. Uh, we have Peter Paul Porges with Victor Borg is taller. We have George Woodbridge with the US Army Builds Men. We have a t-shirt by Mort Drucker, which has dry clean. And then we have another one there by Al Jaffe that says, what single word describes Al Jaffe? Sneaky. And one thing that you may not have actually noticed about this, if you turn it upside down, it actually has a picture of Al Jaffe's face just there, which I never noticed before, but I thought was quite cool. Uh, and then last but not least, you have Don Martin on that page. So on the next page, uh, we have another one by Jack Rickard there. Uh, we have Nick Meglin, which has boars. Uh, we have Sergio Aragones, which says, Read Viva Mad, Mad About Mad, Madly Yours, In Mad We Trust, Mad as the Devil by Sergio Aragones. Of course, those are all paperback books by Sergio. Uh, we have Dave Berg, Berg's Eye View. Uh, we have Bob Clark, and he says, Kiss Me, I'm Nothing. And we have Norman Mingo that says, very interesting. And then we have Angelo Torres, which says, the joy of a sweaty t-shirt. And last but not least, we have Jack Davis, who had done Bill Gaines. Now, this Bill Gaines, from the head upwards, has been used many times over in different areas. And you could go and have a look on Facebook for that discussion if you wanted to. So his shirt says, What Me Worry, and Alfred says, Ditto. Anyway, it has some more information about what the t-shirts were about, but overall, I thought this was a collectible, as it had a lot of original art that hadn't been used elsewhere. Okay, that's all for this item. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Catch you next time.